This is the process shot. I'm Michael, I'm stuck in a movie theater, and I've seen Hell's a Poppin', a genre-bending comedy from 1941 directed by H.C. Potter. Based on their already plotless Broadway show by the same name, the film opens on the vaudeville duo Olsen and Johnson during the making of a film called Hell's a Poppin', which is interrupted by their director, who says that the studio wants them to add a love story to the mix. The film then shifts to that new story, which still features the two, but adds a host of new characters engaged in a story of a love triangle filled with mishaps, misadventure, a few songs, and a slow realization that anything still goes in this show. That may be a bit of an exaggeration, but for the most part, the film follows that credo. It doesn't shy away from the story in favor of jokes and slapstick, but rather uses it as a platform for comedy, breaking the fourth wall at multiple opportunities to talk with people in the viewing audience, and even the theater projectionist, who is a character within the film, so it's not quite the same. But whatever, it's still fun. The love story itself is a bit simplistic and undeveloped, likely by design given how it's initially treated when introduced as studio interference. It's still given some attention, but it's more like a guide for the movie to follow rather than an actual structure that holds it all up. As such, it's not easy to talk about Hell's a Poppin' without being a sort of scene-by-scene -scene play of the film. But the movie doesn't suffer at all for this. It's more that the comedy of the film is what's given focus, and thus it's what sticks out above the rest of the elements. The technicals are pretty standard, the acting works well enough, and the musical numbers are, well, a bit of a distraction, but they're still fun in how they play with the film medium. Overall, I feel like this is a movie that goes out of its way to try and defy description, or at least make it difficult. Hell's a Poppin', H.C. Potter, 1941. Four stars. I recommend seeing it, if you can find it. And that's it for the review. Likes are liked, comments are collected, and subscriptions are supportive. I'm gonna need to start making a list of movies to rewatch if they ever come back to this theater. Come to think of it, does this theater even have a name? <laughs>